Hello and welcome. Today we'll talk about the network snipper. Under runtime snap status, it's the second thing. Item. The network sniffer page is great for troubleshooting. You can monitor both public IP network interfaces and the overlay network interfaces of BNS3 controllers. This page includes some basic guidance for syntax here at the bottom. In the event your filter expression is malformed, the page will result in a expression syntax error. When you're using Network Sniffer, a few things to note. The page does not auto-refresh, so once you enter the expression, be sure to click this refresh button right here. And also the interface toggle is an important feature. It's either ETH0 or TON0. ETH0 is for the public IP network interface. This is all encapsulated IPsec traffic and unencrypted VLAN traffic. TON0 is for your overlay network interface. So for example, we'll use it in troubleshooting an encrypted tunnel to see if there is normal negotiation and keep alive traffic. Um, we've got two VNS3 controllers connected over an IPsec tunnel, so we'll just make sure that it's alive. So we'll do SRC and then the IP address of the other instance. Click Start. And remember, it doesn't automatically refresh, so we'll click the Refresh button. So we're in this, we can make sure that the encrypted encapsulated packets are moving in both directions, and to see that there's network connectivity and no firewall issues preventing negotiation. So we'll refresh again for more data. Um, when troubleshooting, we recommend setting up a continuous ping down the tunnel. And another thing to note, never check this verbose output unless told by cohesive networks. If you do, it can fill up the memory very quickly of your instance and then kill your VNS3 underlying instance. So just for fun, we're going to go over to our other controller, our VNS3B, and we will sabotage it. We will delete the endpoint and the tunnel. <clears throat> so over here, Let's go test this again. 